In 10 days, fans can watch the Lamar football team perform for the first time during the season opener against Grambling State. Fans may also see another first, the new Southland Conference instant replay system. Six Sports' Andrew Chernoff got an exclusive tour of the new replay booth earlier today. Provo Stumphrey Stadium is adding something new. It's about getting it right. New technology to make sure all the calls on the field are correct. It literally took me from probably end of June and we're just now finishing it up. Clint Burgess is the Lamar Athletics video coordinator. He's been very busy making sure that the Card Stadium is equipped with instant replay this season. We know it's going to work. It's just a matter of getting all the bells and whistles in place and then that next weekend firing it up and, and hopefully the place doesn't burn down. <laughs> <Absolutely>. <laughs> this year, each Southland Conference school will have full-time instant replay for all home games. The SLC, the first FCS conference to implement such a system. This guy here, the replay operator, every time uh, he reviews every single play. And if he sees something deemed, you know, questionable, uh, then he kind of turns to this guy and says, hey, let's go ahead and start queuing them up and get it ready. The two conference officials in the booth would then buzz the officials on the field. Okay, so right now this is actually vibrating in my hand because, Clint, you pushed a button right. on this yeah. board. It's easy from there. The replay operator just views the play from the six different replay cameras inside the stadium. All the clips are going over here to where he can watch them, different angles. They're already time synced, they're already generated time code. If you're a fan watching the game and the action in front of you stops because of a review, you will not be able to watch that replay on the video board. The reason being, the Southland Conference does not want your reaction to the play influencing the officials in the booth. We're allowed to show one replay off of the play before it goes to a review, but you know, that's just basic gameplay. Another way to make sure there's no outside influence in the booth, only a select number of people have access to the room. It's just a keypad, and, and only those four guys, five guys, including myself, have that keypad code, and that's it. So, with all of that going into the new replay system, there is only one question left to ask. Will this work? I've been in the South for August, will be in 10 years. Uh, the schools, uh, whether they have no money, money, whether they have left staff, the, these schools find a way to get it done. Done in time for week one next week. At Provost Free Stadium, Andrew Chernoff, KFDM 6 Sports.